hello lovers and also wonderful subscribers on this channel you are all welcome to billy's now's logo Liga tv and this is the revealed with billy right away yes we wanted to show you how airport looks like when you are from the seven hospital area heading towards airport so yes we wanted to show you how beautiful this you know environment is someone just requested for this and we have to do that so as you can see the cbg bank is on your left yes and you can see how nice it is you will see that and also the standard section you can see the vodafone you know sky building and this is the holiday inn hotel just close to the terminal 3 so right away we are just heading towards the terminal 3 and this is the link to the terminal 3 on my right so as if you are moving to that section you could see that there's a high buildings a tall buildings and you will love it the environment is clean and serene and yes it is one of the best places that you love to always visit if you are in ghana so there's a terminal three signboard you know that's where the planes jet off and there's a lot of you know hotel vehicles that comes around to let me say take people to their hotels so there's a holiday hotel very 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 close so mostly people book holiday in hotel for their stay because it's very close to the terminal 3 you wouldn't have yourself so long to walk and also so long to move from the airport so this is what you're watching right here this is a revealed we are going to travel and reveal anything that you tell us so please you can drop your comment and also test us or call our line and tell us our next destination and also our next video that you would love to see on the screen right there so you can see the marina mall just when we're starting the video yes people also requested to showcase the marina mall so you are going there some days to come and get you the view of marina mall so people are just going to park their cars here when you park your cars at that lane at the se at that se sector yes you're going to pay for it because if anything should happen to your vehicle you have them to blame so yes you can just have your car parked there then you pay something little for them so this is you know the route to the terminal three yes you can just you know drive you know upwards when you drive downwards you will go into the arrival section but when you drive up post, there is the terminal 3 departure section that's where you will see people you know um boarding off to just you know have their own place of stay and also travel to any part of the country by using a tube so you can see a lot of cars are moving there for there you can park yes so if you are listening and you're watching over this video all over the world you can park at the terminal 3 um departure section yes so you can just you know go there and let me see get your phone members and your you know loved ones going then you can come back down to the, the, the terminal 3 you know parking area and park and this is one of the best places that you love to go and have your lunch or you love to visit so you can see there's a restaurant the first ghana airways for ghana the first plane which ghana bought and it was our national plane has now turned to one of the best restaurants that you love to always be in it so when you enter you see that yes it's been designed like a restaurant but you are in a plane enjoying yes so it's fault and someone needs to buy it and you know um, we change the formality of it into a restaurant to make it into a useful use so it is a critical this is a parking area i was talking about you can park here for me as many as you know many days you can spend you can park here and if in case there's anything wrong with the car or if in case there's any harm on your car it's on your own fault or it's going to be on your own bill because there's nothing to show that you can park as long as you want so on your own risk you can park that's it so there's the arrival and there's the departure as you can see i told you so those wearing the blue blue you know um shirts are those
drivers who works at the airport, the taxi drivers who works at the airport, they have been, you know, registered to work there. So they've been given a uniform. So this is, you know, the prayer and the arrival section. And I just have to move downwards to see if I can get to another, you know, section. This is, a, you know, water and fire service water hydrant. Yes, and this place is, you know, the washrooms for the female and male section. I can't enter because people are using it. Yes, so you can see the immigration um, um, immigration office is just at where they are moving and you can see there's a plane down there which you, you um, they are starting boarding so the Ethiopian airline is there people who have started you know boarding yes, so you can see that you can just you know enter you wouldn't see anything then you will just see that you entered so this is a COVID-19 test um, place that you can have it so if you want to have it, uh, you COVID-19 test. Now it's official that if you want to travel, you should just register and have your COVID-19 test ready. So that's the plane we saw there has just you know, set off. It's in the air now. We saw it that it was London and now it's in the air now. So it's so nice to come to this place. Since you can't come all the time and since you can't have access to always walk around airports, I'm just going to reveal everything for you. So Aquaba means welcome. So as you can see, with the one with Kente displaying, you know, Ghana heritage, so it's Aquaba. What I'm showing right now is the satellite of Ghana Airport. This satellite is very, very, very long. Mostly wherever you stand in Ghana, Accra, and it's on the hill, you will see that satellite blinking red and green. Mostly, when you want to see the, the light, it's mostly seen in the evening. Very, very tall. Yes, so if you're on a hill, you could see from afar. And you can see that it's blinking and it rotates. So we are moving to the old airport. That's the terminal one. This was our initial airport. Our departure and also our airport. That's where we are heading towards. Yes, and when I got there, they were having some, you know, renovations and also uh, reconstruction and rehabilitation of the airlines and also. And you see, you are, you know, entering into a zone area. So I, I tried flying my drone, but it wasn't working because I don't have access to it. So I wanted to even, even have access and register. So I was told to go to that building, that tall building you see in the glass building, to have my, uh, my drone registered. So I have to do that, and I did that. So that is the terminal one. This is a walking tour. So please, I want you to see every details in Ghana Airport. So if you see anything which doesn't please you, please kindly drop your comment so that we can also post it for the world to see. No hawking, no lottery. So you can you know, say come and sell and buy pure water and you know food stuff here, plantain chairs, plastic chairs, no. You will be seeing and you'll be hearing you know people you know, shouting, screaming for the you know, say, adverts. And this is the Madan department. Madan, we all know one of the business you know, gurus right here in Ghana who has a lot of ships doing imports and exports. And this is the private, you know, jet from Magdan. If you want a private jet, Magdan is having its own private jet. So if you want a private jet, you know, tour or a private jet to move to any of the countries, Magdan will do that for you. So that's the Magdan Aviation. Yes, well designed and well furnished. We weren't able to enter because it's strictly by invitation. So. This is the back side of the airport and we will be heading towards where they fuel their airport and uh, their planes. Yes. People were asking, what do they use in fuel? Um, we don't actually know the actual name, but someone said they use kerosene, but they don't use diesel and petrol. Yes. So I don't know the actual name, so someone can also drop in the comments the main fuel for you know planes you can drop it if you know so we all learn out of it 
they are revealing what we see so as you can see there's a lot of planes parked inside i wasn't supposed i'm not supposed to get close so i have to zoom and you can see there's a plane landing this is a landing you know plane that just you know, got down in ghana i don't know if you've seen a private uh, plane i don't know if it's you know a government plane or i don't know if it's a domestic plane so there's the area shot and also this is the aviation sector you can see the four you know tanks down there so when they call for any force footage then you can see that the russian to take the four to the planes there's a one plane which is you know jetting off so this is a view in the airport so if you don't know we have revealed this to you kindly subscribe to Billy Snaps and Logoliki TV and get all wonderful updates and wonderful revealed in that channel my name is Billy and I am your host on the review with Billy right away enjoy your stay and please share the video for the world to see what we have here in Africa and what you will see when you come to Ghana Airport Thank you all for your time. You will call.